Hi everyone and welcome to another video in our geometry tutorial. So before getting started with the video, I think you have noticed that I'm not posting videos regularly, but this is mainly because I have so many exams in this month. So uh, I suggest that you turn on the notification by clicking the bell. Uh, this way you will not miss any uh, new video that I will upload. Okay, so with that being said, let's get started. Okay, so in this video, we'll be discussing our, fa our uh, last center of triangle, and that is the ortho center, H. Okay, so unfortunately, the centroid isn't very, isn't very nice with angles. So don't worry about it. We'll just now discuss the ortho center, and we'll discuss that later. Okay, so now we have the ortho center in our diagram. In our diagram, we have... Uh, triangle ABC and we have the orthocenter H and of course the orthocenter H is the meeting point of the altitudes of the triangle so here we have drawn BH which is the altitude uh, that meets the side AC at F and we have another altitude CH which is uh, meeting AB at E and of course we have two right angles of course H, the orthocenter, is very beautiful with uh, angles because it, it, it creates lots of right, right angles. Okay. In fact, the orthocenter is very nice because by drawing just the altitudes, AH, BH, and CH, you will get uh, more than six cyclic quadrilaterals. Okay, but well, don't worry about that because we haven't discussed the cyclic quadrilaterals yet. But now we'll just do our classical work, and that is to find the angles, to do some angle chasing. So we will find the angle BHC. So this angle right here, BHC. Okay, so actually this is not complicated, because just take a look. We need to find this angle, right? Okay, but take a look at this quadrilateral, A, F, H, E. This angle is the same as this angle, right? Of course. And in this uh, quadrilateral, we have two right angles. And this, we already know this angle. It is A. So basically, what is this angle? What is the angle F, H, E? It is pi minus A, right? We can say that because the sum of the angles of a quadrilateral is 2 times pi, right? So this is basically pi minus A. Of course, and that means that this is as well pi minus a okay so actually we're done because we already have bhc is equal to pi minus a and this is our angle okay okay so what about the angle ecb ecb so what about this angle here well Take a look at the triangle CEB. We have this right, a right angle, right? This one here. And we know that this, the whole angle this, is B. That means that this angle is simply pi over 2 minus B. Right? Okay, so simply now we have that ECB, the angle ECB is simply pi over 2 minus b. Of course, here we're discussing uh, acute triangles, but don't worry about uh, obtuse triangles because they are just the same. We can discuss them in the same way. Okay, and what about the angle FBC? Well, just it is just the same, but let's just clear this here. And this angle right here will be simply pi over 2 minus c. Okay, so as a conclusion, let's just clear these angles here. Okay, so now what we have shown in uh, our orthocenter that the angle BHC is simply pi minus a. And we have also shown that the angles ECB, this angle ECB is simply pi over 2 minus b and the angle fbc 
c is simply pi over 2 minus c. So this is basically every or, or all the angles that you need to know when dealing with the orthocenter. And in the next video, because we have finished the three centers of triangle, we will discuss our first magical symmetry uh, that we will talk about in our next video. Okay, so see you in the next video.